Right. All right. Here with Amy Cashian, just took the W in the women's steeple chase at the USATF Distance Classic. We were just talking a little bit, like America's kind of came became like your second home, just being here since college. Yeah, I was lucky enough to come to college here under Sean Cleary at WVU, and they've definitely become my second family here, taking me and looking after me, especially during the pandemic when I couldn't go home. I always had people like. I felt like I was at a second home, so I've been very lucky being in America. And you said you're doing some coaching too while yeah. you're training. How do you balance that? Uh, it, I'm someone who needs to be doing a lot of things in order to be successful. So I coach when I can, I travel with the girls and the team. Um, I help them out with the mental side of things as well, like just preparing for races because they've been there. Um, and it's nice because I get to do like runs with them and everything, so it helps benefit me as well. And I see you have your Olympic rings. Was that your first Olympic team that you it made was, just was, last year? It was my first Australian senior team. I made a junior team back in the day. So it was finally great to be able to represent Australia at the senior level. Um, it's just, I was so excited. About it. What, is, what is it going to take for you to repeat and do the same thing and make it to the World Championships this year? I just have to keep getting faster and faster. We had our Australia trials already. Um, I got the win there, so that puts me in a good place. However, I was just like one second off the time today, so just need to get in another race and we go a little bit quicker and hopefully I can go on to that 9.30 and go to the World Champs because I'm very keen to put on the green and gold again, but also to run in Eugene because their track is unreal. Yeah, what does that mean? Like with the with this becoming like your second home and now we have our first world championships here in Eugene how exciting is that to just know it's so exciting I think you know my family and friends from Australia said they'd come over nice. and watch but then because they couldn't come to Tokyo but then also at the same time I have all my friends and my, my second family here that can come watch so it'll be a big big affair and it's just I wouldn't be where I am without either of them and so just being able to have them there as support and um, cheering me on which I'm hoping will happen obviously they've not been selected yet but it'll mean the world to me because I miss having them there in Tokyo awesome well Amy where can we where can we catch you next and like where can people find you and learn more about uh, you so uh, my Instagram is amstar94 like A-M-S-T-A-R um, and then I think I'm going to be running Portland but I've got to reevaluate my coach what's next after this uh, but I'll be doing some more races around America for sure alright well looking forward to see you around on the circuit Amy thank, thank you, you so much alright